hey everybody. Come on in. Let me share a couple things here real quick. I'm trying to get them shared to the group. I think I've got it. Hold on. Whoops, that's not the right one. Ah. Here we go. I'm trying to pin a comment. Come on in, everybody. Woohoo, I'm going to have some fun today. I'm trying to find. I've got. Oh, no, I don't have that over there. Give everybody a second to kind of pop in. I am in my fall frame of mind today. Again. <laughs> hey, Mary Jo. I'm trying to get the picture, I'm not going to show you yet, of what I'm going to do today. Look, I even got myself a nice pretty fall, a little fall wreath back here. It was on sale from Albertsons. I'm like, yes. Hey, Sharon. You guys, we're going to do some fun stuff today again. Woohoo! See my shirt? I'm with Creepy. <laughs> so, that should give you an idea of possibly what I'm doing. But I'm going to start off, I'm not showing you the picture, kind of like I did the other day. I'm going to start off doing something, and then I'm going to trans, kind of transition over to my um, Halloween face. But yeah, I've got some things going on here. I'm just trying to, I mean, it's still like 100 degrees out here today. It might be 99 today. I think it's cooling down. But um, I'm I'm going for it. I'm in fall. You're ready to, Mary Jo? Hey, Sharon, how are you? Girl, you need to message me. I never see you anymore, any of your stuff. Um, yeah, I wanted to put a wreath outside and I have all my Halloween stuff put away with my Christmas stuff. So I was in my garage yesterday and I'm like, dang it, I can't even find my wreath holder. Cause so I had to put like a little nail on my door up here, but it was like, where is all my fall stuff? I'm ready to put fall stuff out. I'm over, I'm over you summer. <laughs> I am done with you, breaking up with you and it's you, it's not me. All right, I already moisturized you guys and I am gonna go ahead and do everything just as if it's I was going to be putting on my regular makeup because half of this face up here will be this side right here is going to be regular unique makeup and then I will transition and I'll, I'll kind of let you guess as we go along as to what face I'm going to do for Halloween. Hey Marianne. So I did moisturize already guys. It's dry. I always do that beforehand because I want it to, you know, to really dry on there before I start going in. This is a glorious primer. Ladies, always moisturize and prime your face. Always do that. Always, always. You just don't know what a difference that that is going to make. It's going to keep your makeup from running off during the day. It builds a wonderful foundation for our base for all of your foundation. It, it's amazing. Amazing. Prime. Always prime. <laughs> all right. I told you I changed all my acrylic holders around the other day. And I think I have them over here, but I think I'm going to move them over here probably today sometime because they're out of reach a little bit. And I'm, I've got so much, I've got so much stuff in here. It's crazy. Okay. Letting that primer kind of dry. I'm so excited for this face today. I have not practiced it. I don't know if it's going to turn out. If this gives you any indication of what it might be. <laughs> we'll see. Okay, so let's let that primer set. Mary Jo, I got my nails done yesterday. Look. Aren't those cool? It's kind of, um, I mean, they are like an orange, brown. It's kind of like a pumpkin. It's kind of like a pumpkin color. Whoops, can you see? I love it. I was like skimming through, and I was thinking about maybe doing a purple or something like that again. And um, I was at the nail salon, I was skimming through, and I'm like, oh, that's it. That's my color. I didn't do my toes though. I only do my toes like every other. I told you, I told you my anxiety about the, the whole nail salon thing and how they cut me all the time and dig into that one toe. So I can only do that like once a month. I can't, I can't hang with that. That just freaks me out because they're brutal. <laughs> all right, you guys, I'm going to do nimble, you know, my go-to color because this eye right here, like I said, from like he, here over, is going to be my normal look. So I'm just going to do one eye. But this is called Nimble. This is a beautiful base color, you guys. If you're ever just looking for something quick 
and you just want to kind of go out of the house and put a little color on your eyes so it just looks so washed out. That's your color, man, right there, nimble. Hey, Jean. Jean, you just looked beautiful in your pictures, girl, your wedding pictures. Congratulations to you and Jimmy. Right on. Hey, Tina. So, like I said, we're just doing one eye, and that's it with the unique. Or what I would like to say would be the regular, regular makeup. I was going to do this one the other night, but it's it actually seems kind of comp. It actually seems more complicated than like Wonder Woman and all that stuff. So, I've been studying the picture and trying to figure out how I was going to do it. So I'm just doing this nimble all over. All over. Look at my pretty wreath, you guys. I'm all into fall. What are you up to today, Tina? Okay, so that nimble is going all over. Now I am still gonna, dang it, my picture went off. I am still gonna do um, all my foundation and such because the makeup that I'm using, I just think it might have a better better grip on it. Hey, Sarah. Not that I'm going out like this dressed later when I do it. Like I said, just one eye here with Unique today. Um, so I'm going to do the nimble. Let's do, I think I'm going to do the fervent. God, I stick my finger in that thing every time. Crap. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? I'm going to do fervent. And I think for a darker color, I don't even know if I want a darker color in there. Let me just do the fervent first and see what it looks like. Thanks guys for all popping in. It's Halloween day again. I'm with Creepy. <laughs> I bought this shirt like two, three years ago at Halloween. I think it was like a Walmart or something. I'm like, I love that shirt. I wish I could wear that shirt like all the time. <laughs> hey Teresa. Okay, so I'm gonna put a little, I did the nimble. And like I said, I'm just doing one eye right now. Stay tuned. It's going to be cool. I just got to figure out what I want to do with this. I'm just, I'm not going to do too much with this eye. I want this eye to stay somewhat, somewhat mellow. Because <laughs> I don't want to take away from the side of the face that I'm doing over here. Which I'm not going to tell you what it is just yet. I love this fervent. Oh my gosh, I love this color. It's kind of, um, I'll show you again. It's kind of a red brown. It is a gorgeous color. Hey, Lori. How are you today, darling? We're going to do a creepy face. I'm with creepy today. So I'm just doing one eye, Lori. Hey, Leona. Okay, I think, like I said, I want this to kind of stay. I want to use my unique products and make a nice eye with it for this look, but I don't want to take away from what I'm doing over here either. So if that, I know that doesn't make sense to y'all right now. It'll make sense. Good Lord. I got, I'm like shutting. Oh, my thyroid is acting crazy. I went and brushed my hair the other day and I swear I just pull like a ton of hair out of my hairbrush. It's like, thank God I have a lot of hair. Leona, what are you doing today, girl? It's fall here today. Not really. It's cooling down, I think, to 99 today, maybe. <laughs> so I've got my fall. Look at that. I'm shedding everywhere. Holy cow. I have enough to make like a, a wig for someone that I lose hair. Anybody else lose hair like that? Okay, I'm just going to blend that out with the same brush. Just a little bit. I don't know... I'm looking at my picture. I can't show you the picture yet. Okay, let's do some um, pencil. Oh, there's another one. Holy, holy capoli, Batman. All right, just hold down your eye. You're going to go in your bottom waterline. I'm going to take this lick all the way over. Normally, I only go about a quarter to a half of the way over. No shopping, no kahuna, baby. Aw. I still have to go. I've got to go to the grocery store again today. I don't know why I do that. I should just get everything on one trip. Hey, Alice. Yeah, I went out yesterday and didn't get all my errands done, so i got to go back out again today. 
Mary Jo, it's 80. You're waiting on that storm. I know. I was watching it this morning on the news. Alice, I haven't seen you for a while. How are you? Thanks for coming in. Okay, to get up into that waterline, I have to actually hold my eyelashes up. I'm not good enough just to go and swipe it out there without jabbing my eye out. Okay. I'm going to keep that pencil out. It's going to come in handy in just a little bit. All right, let's do some eyeliner. This look calls for a winged eye over here. I get myself tickled every time because it's like, I cannot do that winged eye. I cannot do it. For the life of me, darn it, I can't do it. I can do it like in a Halloween look, but this side of the eye is supposed to look normal. I'm going to try a little bit with it. I'm going to get myself laughing. And I'll just, it'll start watering down my face anyway. Let's see. She's got it going. She's got it all the way into the inner there, the inner V. I haven't been on the, oh, we haven't been on the same channel lately. Oh, you're off this afternoon. Yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna do something tonight and then I just thought, you know what, I'm just sitting here. I'm just sitting here pretty much doing nothing. I might as well go on and, and play around with you all. I've got so much going on with this house, but nothing, nothing today, so. That's good. I know, Alice. Isn't that the best? We were just talking about that. I just got my nails done yesterday. I love this color. I love it. I may do that like all fall. I'll be like every two weeks just, I think it was number 57. <laughs> number 57, please. Hey, Lynette. I'm just going to kind of thicken that up a little bit. I don't really know what color it is. It's a gel, pol gel polish. Um, but it's kind of like an orange brown. It's very cool. It's kind of pumpkin-y. See, my winged eye looks good when I hold my skin. <laughs> if I sit here and hold it like that, it would probably just stay pretty. See, it goes down. So I have to actually over-exaggerate it to go up. Uh, you've been wearing dip nail. I'm not sure if I know what that is. I'm letting this dry, y'all, before I let my skin go back down. Dip nail. It is. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, let's go up underneath this eye. Oh Lord, Alice. Me and these winged eyes. It's almost like a cruel joke. It's like whoever. Whoever decided that you should wing your eye? Who did that? Let me at him. Okay, she actually is connecting her eye. See if I could just, if I could get a tuck like this, it'd take like five years off. Okay, I'm just kind of letting that dry. I think it turned out okay. It's okay for Halloween. I don't know if I tried any other time. Okay, so that's kind of, she has a very basic eye. Let me go in. Let's do a little mascara on this eye, and then I'll do some foundation on, I'm going to do foundation all over before I do the Halloween. It's a powder color. Okay. Oh! Oh! I never heard of that, Alice. Hey, Trisha. I guess because I've, I've been doing my nails 
oh my gosh, probably forever. But um, mainly because I'm actually in like a customer service as a flight attendant. So, you know, when you're handing somebody a drink or something, you don't want to have like scraggly fingernails or something and handing them something that they're going to like be drinking. So I always try to make sure that I have them done. Sometimes I let them go a little longer than two weeks, but they were really growing out this last time. You guys, I'm doing the black for this look, the black mascara, the smudge proof. And I'm going to do eyebrows on this side too, just the side you guys were doing right now. Oh, thank you, Alice. Alice, I parted it differently because my gray hair was coming in on this side over here a little too much. So I changed my part, but that's kind of all I really did to it. Yesterday I was having the darndest time because, you know, your peripheral vision, it kept coming this way and I wasn't used to hanging in my face on this side. And it was just, it was freaking me out all day yesterday. I think I'm used to it now. <laughs> it's funny what just changing like a certain part will do. And I always have to have my big Texas hair. Usually I try to pull that up and spray it a little bit. I like my, I like my poof in the back. My prom hair. <laughs> hey, Agnes. I am going to do a second coat of this Epic because I really want these eyelashes to pop even more than what they're doing um, for this look. But okay. so I'm kind of going a little heavy on it. A little heavy. I'm not even wiping that product off like I normally do. I'm so excited about this Halloween look I'm going to do, guys. Like I said, look at my shirt. I should tell you, and if you've seen the pictures on my website, that might give you an idea what I'm going to do. There's probably two on there that you might be thinking, but it's going to be cool. Okay, I will do another coat, unless I forget, which I've been known to do. Yeah, Alice, I have to have her um, kind of like put a little bit of layer back here because the weight of my hair will, will take my poof down. And I like my poof. <laughs> I love my poofy hair. Okay. Let me see. This is the one that I concocted yesterday. This is uh, the Liquid Touch. And I had just a little bit of taffeta left in here and I added velour to it. But I only have it filled like maybe to he like here. So that's what I used yesterday. It seemed to, seemed to look all right. I'm guessing it looked all right. Oh, thank you, Sarah. Yeah, you guys share, invite people. It should be interesting. I'm gonna have to actually pull my hair back when I do this other look to get over there because it's gonna take it's gonna take some work. It's gonna take some work. All right, let me do my foundation brush. And like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and put foundation all over. I don't really need to use that much, but it, um, only because I want a good base with that. I don't even really know if I want, well, I better do concealer too, because of the left side. Hey, Jessica. We're doing kind of a half Halloween face tonight, and I haven't told anybody what it is yet. Here's your hint. I'm with Creepy. <laughs> I love this shirt. I could wear Halloween shirts all the time. I'm going to put a little bit more foundation on this side because this is the side that's staying normal. I do need to put some over here, though, just because I'm going to be putting all that over there, this makeup. How fun is this, guys? I went out, like I said, I, I've been using Unique products, and I've been trying to only stay with the Unique products for my Halloween looks, other than my white out the other day. Um, but for this look, I had to I had to go out and buy some um, of the white. Where's it at? Oh, gosh, that wind is blowing again. I had to buy some of this white cream makeup because I don't really have anything in that color in the amount that I have to use. I can't get away with my white out. 
Okay, just take your foundation brush and just cut. Make a nice cut line right there. I haven't put an eyebrow, an eyebrow over here yet, so bear with me. I'm not too worried about this side over here just yet. Which would be my right side. Okay, so let me get rid of this stuff off my desk that I don't, I'm not using right now. Man, my nose, oh, allergies are killing me out here still today. It's awful. Okay, she has, she has a little bit of bronzer. Let's go ahead and do that. Well, I better draw my eyebrow in before I forget, then I won't have an eyebrow. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do the black, the dark. Because this is kind of just in black and white, so than what I've got on here. All right, here we go. Again, just create your shape around your eyebrow. If you don't have a shape of an eyebrow, like I don't in a couple areas up here, I'm just going where I think it should be. Creating a little bit more of an arch over here today. And I'll blend all this out, blend all this out with my spoolie when I'm done. And I'm just doing light little strokes, you guys, just little, little feathery strokes. You can go backwards so you get underneath that hair, what hair there is in mine. Um, go backward and that gets up underneath of there. did pretty good with that. I don't really need to do too much straightening. A little bit right there. Okay, so that's my, this is my half, and I haven't done my, my bronzer and lipstick, because I actually have lipstick on half of the side, which I may wait and do the lipstick last, um, just because I can't show you yet. Okay, the Beach Run Bronzer. This is Hermosa. that pretty look how that just look at that just barely touched it that's gorgeous hey Tiffany little contouring up here I do not go all the way across with my contour guys I just go up a little bit lightly blend you don't want to rip all your foundation off y'all okay see the difference that that made Look at that, and I don't even have my lipstick and stuff on yet. It's amazing. Amazing. Okay, I don't need any more of that. I will put a little bit of setting powder on that side too. What do y'all think so far? Are you excited? Does anybody have any idea what face I'm gonna do over here yet? Have you all been watching my, my page with all those pictures that I posted earlier? Like, I think last week. This is your clue. See that see that skeleton hand? I'm with creepy. You guys think you know what it is? Oh you know what I do want to do some hang on. I wanted to put some contour on that side of the nose too. Let's see. Make sure I've got the right one here. You guys gotta make better guesses than that. What does that look like? What does that remind you of? I know y'all can guess better than that. Okay, I'm going to do a little bit of my, um, where's it at? my benevolent luminizer. Okay. 
Okay, so there's my side. That is my finished side other than my lipstick because I'm not going to do my lipstick until I do my creepy side first. But what I'm going to be doing is this color Stoic and the Splash. So that one, when I put that on, it's only going to be over Frankenstein. Good guess, but Frankenstein, no, Frankenstein's not, he's more of a monster. That's a good look, though. I might try a Frankenstein face. Not Frankenstein. Keep guessing. Keep guessing. So, like I said, I had to break down, y'all, and buy the white makeup um, from the Halloween stuff because I don't really have white. This is going to take a lot of white. So, let me put my hair back over here a sec. There we go. Got my bronzer away. I don't need that. I'm trying to decide what brush I'm going to put this on with. Probably, probably just use my regular foundation brush. I guess. I don't know. You can't see the hand that good. Can you see it now? Keep guessing. No, not Casper. I am going to do something similar to a Casper, though. I have a picture of that, too. Now, I don't really know how this works. I don't know how much to put on. <laughs> it's my first time out with it, so bear with me. I have no idea. Let me see. She's got it. Now, she's just got it down. Oh, gosh, that's a lot. <laughs> that might be too much. Good Lord. Good Lord. Hold on. All right. Hey, Renee. I'm trying to keep that over to one side. There we go. Oh, I've already got it in my hair, too. Let's see where she's going with it. I may have to fine tune that with a, a smaller brush. I didn't do a patch test on this, so <laughs> let's hope that I'm not allergic to it. Well, maybe I do need a little bit more. I'm pretty much rubbed that, rubbed that off. Hey, Leslie. Hey, Renee. Jessica, Freddy Krueger, no. Not Freddy Krueger. Okay, I think that that's all she has. I think. I just want to get that base of that white down first. The Reaper. I guess it could kind of be called a reaper in a sense she doesn't really have a name it's more of just um, a look I would say than actual um, like a figure like a, the name of somebody okay I think that I've got most of that I don't really want to get that up in my hair more than I already have. I may have to come back and do some more with that. I don't know yet. I am definitely going to have to wash that brush tonight. Okay, so my splurge eye cream. This is the color Skeptical, which is just black. So that is going to go all over my eye. Let me make sure I got it right. Now, in that Halloween kit, there came black, like black makeup, but I don't really want to put anything that, that came from another country or God only knows. The Corpse Bride? No, not the Corpse Bride. I figured I would just stay safe with our cosmetics around my eye. There 
Are you guys ready for me to show you what it is? Do you guys want to see what it is? If you want to see what it is, I want to see some loves and likes over there. I want to see that thing light up over here. That not only helps my algorithm, but lets me know that what you're all thinking. Everybody ready to see? I better see some more likes and loves than that or I'm not going to show it. I'm bribing you. I'm not going to do it. There they are. All right, hold on. Okay, this is the look. This is what I'm doing. Can y'all see that? It's gonna look kind of creepy. I gotta see how her mouth is with her teeth. I did that on my um, scary doll face. It's kind of, it's a little tricky. I've only done it once to make the mouth go over like that. It's, once you do it though, I mean it took me a little while that night. I wasn't doing a live video when I did it. Mrs. Death, it might be. This really isn't a, the dark, the dark, dark black like I wanted it to look like. But I just don't want to put that, I just don't want to put that black makeup on my face and then have issues. At least not up around my eye. Hold on, let me just go a little bit more down here and then I'm going to go down and start doing the other parts. I almost look like a dog. <laughs> like Spot. That's not the look I'm going for though. Okay, so I need to do, I need to kind of take this over a little bit. So it's not such a harsh line. Let's see, where's my, where's my makeup? I'm going to do this with my finger. Okay. I want to soften it up so it's not such a harsh line up there. Oops, wiped it wider off. And when that dries, when that dries, it flakes right off. Use a pressed shadow black, just wet the brush. I know, Alice, I'm going to go back and do something with it. You're, that's a good idea. I'll put some rose water on it. I don't have the black. Well, maybe uh, I've got something kind of black. It's not completely black, though. I may have to figure out something with that. I could actually take that pencil, too, the eye pencil. Okay, let me just see what else she's got with this white before I put the white back here again. There's a couple areas, it's just, it's a little more softened. It's not quite as, let's see, she's got a little bit more, it's a little bit darker white right here. Okay. All right. <laughs> I don't know, this is, you know, this these looks sometimes are really, they're not as easy as what you might think that they would be. Alright, what I want to do next is, where's my little, now oh, this is the stuff, no, it's not easy to work with Alice. This is like some of the stuff that it came with. So for that black, I just don't want to put this black up around my eye. I mean, all I need is for it to like have a reaction and completely break out or something. Probably gonna have to use in my pencil. This isn't gonna be. This isn't gonna be as good as I thought it was. This brush is kind of. This is not one of our brushes. This is one of the kit brushes.
Gosh, you know, I can remember trick-or-treating when I was younger. And I'd throw an old flannel shirt on and some baggy jeans and take a pillowcase out and go trick-or-treating. Y'all remember that? It's really turned into some high-tech stuff these days, huh? Well, gosh, do, do kids even go trick-or-treating these days? I don't even think they do, do they? Is that not PC anymore? You're not allowed to trick-or-treat? We don't get them where we're at because we're on the end of an easement road. So we would, even if kids could come out here, there's really no reason for anybody to be down our street. I'm going to go up and fine tune that a little bit with something else. Okay. The fun part's going to be doing, which I think I'm going to do that with my eyeliner pencil. Man, my nose is running again. Okay. I got to get all her lines right. So, you guys, this is. This is where I'm going. <laughs> not there yet, because I still got to do the mouth. The mouth is actually not as hard, but I want to get it here on my face first. So let me do, let's see, she's got, Do around the eye yet because I still have to go do you know what, before I do that let me try that I'm gonna try that with the wet brush let me find let me find a brush I want to use okay let's put some rose water on that and I'll try it with this other black that I have but it's not really black black it's um what's this color here I don't know what color is that shrewd that might work with the wet brush and darken that up but if not if not I may go in if I can I just got over having an eye infection because of my granddaughter's birthday party but let's see well it's not really making it any darker you guys even with the wet brush. She does have her eyebrows done in black though. Let's see. Hey guys, thanks for coming in. We're working on um, a skeleton half face. Oh, thank you for sharing, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. I guess I should could probably, I could probably put some um, mascara on here too. This is just an eye pencil. This is our unique pencil. But that eyeshadow is just not getting dark enough. What did I spend? Yeah, I, I have not ordered that one. The black. The black. I didn't really think I would need it. I ordered everything else, so seems like something something's in double. <laughs> oh sh oh sh. Don't touch your nose. All right, let's see if I can clean this up a little bit more straight in the lines. Okay, so let's do this up around her eye. She has a little line here. 
oh, you know, I want to do my eyeliner with that. Well, you know what these are supposed to be, these lines on here, but maybe they're like a vein or something. I have no idea. Okay, I need to actually mix a little black in here to shade it gray in some areas. Let me go ahead and do, let me go ahead and do the mouth. I gotta remember how I did this. Let's see. Hey Monica, cracks, is that what it is? Hey guys, Deborah, cracks in the skull, yeah, you're right, that's what it is. I want to soften that up with some black and make some gray areas, and I'm probably going to go back up in there. I need to put some mascara on that eye, too, but I want to do my mouth first. So then you have to draw you could have went farther with that let me do a little bit more with that hold on okay And I'm going to fill those in probably with some white out to make them pop. She's got, you know, actually I think I might have done that wrong. Okay, hold on. This isn't like scary doll face mouth. Her teeth were inside. I just realized that the teeth on this one's outside. Okay, so her teeth are actually going up. I think what I'm gonna have to do is do the white out. But let me do a little bit of black mixed in here. I'm just gonna put my finger in that splurge cream and see if I can't like gray this up some. Oh yeah, that worked. Oh my gosh, guys, thanks for hanging with me. This is crazy. You can barely touch it because that white comes off when you do it. 
like flakes off. Okay, there's that. It's looking better, huh? I don't look so much like the a puppy dog face. It's getting crazy. I think it's looking creepier now. That little bit of black in there from the splurge cream, it's right on. So I'm gonna do my, I'm gonna use my white out. Oh, you know what? Let me finish down here first. Oh no, I better do this first. Okay, hang on. I think she's got, she's got more cracks than what I did here. Hold on. Let's do another. She doesn't really have another crack up here, but. I want another crack up there. There. I like the cracks. What do you guys think so far? Anybody? Remember, she's going to have lipstick over here too, so it's supposed to look like the half face. So I have to actually draw. I have to use my white out. I'm probably going to die from like toxic materials from using these things in my mouth. <laughs> All right, let's see. These are going to be teeth, and then I'm going to take the um, black around it. I might have messed that one up a little bit. Do not eat white out at home. I can taste it already. It doesn't taste good. Do you want me to show you what I'm doing here so far, guys? Look. Now my nose is running. See her teeth? So I'll do the black around that in just a sec. I'm trying to see how far she has them go out. That's a big tooth. Okay, I probably should let that dry for a second. That looks good, look at that. While that's drying, let me put some of that mascara on the side too. Are you getting impressed, Alice? It's coming together. I'm going to put another coat on this other eye, too.
Okay, now I've got to finish my teeth. I think that I just want to make sure that dries. And then she's got more cracks down here. I gotta put some lipstick on. I think that might be it. Okay, how's she doing this? She's got that. I just went over that black a little too much, so I want to kind of... What do y'all think? Is it coming together? Okay, she's got a dark line that comes over here. You like it? <laughs> Let's see some likes and loves, guys. You don't know how hard this is. Little encouragement. Okay, we should get this going. Thank you guys for the likes and loves. I think I have it all. Hang on. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. So for that side, oh wait, she's got more coming over here. I didn't see this. And that's all filled in black. I gotta put lipstick still on, regular lipstick, and I'm gonna use that stoic. Kind of creeps me out. <laughs> okay, I want to. I want to blow my nose like so bad right now. All right, I don't know how I'm gonna do this with the without getting it on my without getting it on my teeth. <laughs>
I can't get it on there without touching my teeth. These teeth. All right, I think I got it, guys. made me tired okay all right y'all there she blows what do you think <laughs> pretty cool huh pretty cool I think I got it I'm not quite sure about this eye thing going up here, though. It's still bugging me. I think she has it more squared off. I got it too rounded, I think. Hang on. You guys, please share my videos. So here we go. Look at that. That right there is spot on. Oh, look how when I talk. Watch this, watch my teeth. <laughs> that is creepy. Oh, that cracks me up. I'm gonna wear this all day. <laughs> that is too funny. Oh my God, I love that. doing that all day <laughs> all right oh god that's funny okay and here's the other side so this is all this is completely unique products over here and then this is some unique some not <laughs> Now see, that would be a good look, like an all-over face too, huh? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? <laughs> oh my lord, I'm having way too much fun with this. Okay guys, thank you so much for joining me today. Please share this video. This is a good one. <laughs> I love it. I love it. So creepy that is so creepy oh my god okay guys I think it I think I pulled it off hey Kay the skull face I know I love this I love it it turned out perfect perfect you guys please share this video this is like one of my favorites now I'm loving this this is my unique cosmetic sides this is using the color um, timid and fervent and this uh, stoic in the splash liquid and then I have the dark eye pencil um, the liquid touch foundation I'm wearing is taffeta and a little bit of velour and concealers and organza and then just a little bit of the beachfront bronzer and hermosa which is that right there setting powder and then that is my look for today my Halloween look my shirt I'm with creepy and this was the look that I was trying to pull off y'all I think I did it I think I made it. Whoa. Have a great day, y'all. Um, I may be on here tonight. Maybe I'll just do regular I'll just do some regular makeup. Thank you for sharing all your likes and laughs today. Hey Marilyn, check out my creepy face. My half half face. Ah. <laughs> all right, guys. Thank you so much. If you have any questions, please just message me, friend request to me at Donna Garrett. Check out all my products at beautywithdonna.com. And you guys, today only is 25% off a product. So message me if you're interested in saving 25% off of a product today. If it's something maybe you've been wanting. 
even the collections, any of that. I just can't do the presenter kit, uh, the subscription, or anything that's already discounted, okay? So message me and stay tuned for some more fun. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> I'm going to play with that all day. All right, guys. Bye-bye. Take care.